Hello everybody, welcome back to Minecraft Tutorial. Today we will be doing a video on Cosmos MC. Today we will be explaining and showing how to create a chest shop. Alright, let's begin. So, we're going to be starting with just a regular chest. We're going to be placing it down. It doesn't matter which side you place the shop on, as long as it's facing outward. You're going to do slash QS create 100. Now with that, that creates a shop with whatever item you are holding. So you the QS command, and then once you put a space, that'll be the price. So with that, now all you have to do is left click the shop. It'll pop up a menu here, and then it'll say enter and chat how many you wish to buy, or enter all to buy them all. So for example, if you wanted to buy one golden shovel, you would just type the number one. If you wish to buy all of them, you would type all. And this goes for any number. Now if there was any players walking around in the area they could find this and purchase my shovel for 100 oh looky there there be a goose so just like that he has purchased one golden shovel now this shop is now useless to me so I can do slash QS remove now this chest no longer is a shop and can be broken easily now Let's say I want to build an automatic restocking shop. I'm going to build a super simple one as you can see here. Now with this setup, players will sell to the top. The hopper will automatically load it into the bottom one. So sell, buy. So I want to QS create 100. Now if you notice, this is a sell shop. We're going to do slash QS space buy to turn this into a buying shop. We're going to do QS create 200 to sell. So, as you can see here, any player can just stumble upon this and sell golden shovels to the top shop and buy from the bottom. Now, any player that's in the area can use these. And as you can see, the number automatically changed to 26 but due to the server lag issues we had these signs no longer auto update so all you have to do is walk up and just left click them or right click them to automatically update now I can get my shovel back and the shop is automatic now after you build a shop if you want to get rid of it you can do slash QS remove <laughs> there's a tank then all you have to do is remove it. Slash QS remove gets rid of both. Now you can do anything you want. But now let's say you're a buyer. You want to buy diamond blocks. You can do slash QS find item diamond. Wait a minute. I said that wrong. Find item buy. Then you're going to do diamond underscore block and this takes a second and this will pop up every shop that's currently buying or selling diamond block now this player right here is buying or selling diamond blocks for nine thousand a piece that's crazy see if you click that shop holy this is a beautiful place now what we got here now if some random player was to do slash QS space find item space buy space diamond underscore block they could come buy these 12 blocks of diamond for 9,000 each and slash sell hand and make big profit in order to check sell price you can do slash sop check ores diamond blocks which is thirteen thousand five hundred apiece so somebody could make a little bit of money getting these but let's say I'm gonna buy all these guys blocks so for a hundred and eight thousand dollars I bought twelve blocks of diamond I'm going to do slash QS find item sell diamond underscore block and I'm going to see who is buying diamond block for the most as you can see already lots of people are paying way more so I'm going to go to the Nuggie shop and see he is buying blocks 225,000 each 
I'm going to sell all the blocks. So for a hundred thousand dollars investment, I just made 2.7 million. Will this always be a thing? No, but sometimes you just get lucky. Now with that, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you for coming and have an excellent day. And a quick thank you to Lee Goose 420 for being my terrible unpaid actor. He was very useful for the video. So, you know. Hey, 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 what are you doing?